Greetings out there in YouTube land. This is Morris, man. And as always, I thank you guys for coming to my channel. Today, I'm going to do a update. As you know, I have four DVDs for sale that walk you through learning a lot of course and cutting through the chase as far as being taught things that you never need because we've all been there. I've been there myself personally. I've been to many music teachers when I was younger and they basically taught me the same thing and things that I would never use and the things that I desperately needed to be needed to become a good rhythm guitar player it just wasn't there until I ran into a gentleman at the Conservatory of Music many years ago. And uh, as a result of that, I've put together a very comprehensive uh, four DVD set that's literally almost four hours in length as far as walking you through chords, walking you through logical things that applies to the guitar. So what I'm going to announce today, and I'm very pleased to announce this, is I'm rolling out my DVD number five and six, part two, because the people that purchased DVDs one through four, they got a handful, but there's some other chords that I can teach you guys as far as inversions, uh, slash chords, because some of those chords are going to come up in some of these songs and you want to be able to play them. And the reason why the package that I'm putting together is a little more, I guess, detail is I'm going to only show you the chords that you would use as opposed to a bunch of stuff that you would never use, or even more important, you can't really necessarily physically finger. Because I look at some of the uh, chord charts and some of the, the chords and the diagrams, and I'm like, I need an additional finger to play these chords. So I teach you chords that are very easy to put under your finger, so to speak. Because that was one of the biggest problems I had when I was trying to become a rhythm guitar player when I was younger. Just some of the chords just didn't fit for me. Because they're just some people, uh, certain things work for them and certain things don't. So this DVD is going to be close to probably about 45 minutes in length. Uh, again, I'm going to give you a whole lot of chords as far as new inversions, not difficult to finger. The, the important dreaded slash chords and why they're important because, as you know, when I play my covers, I try to play to the letter. I try to match up the voices as, as accurate as I can. And sometimes when I can't get the exact voicing, I can come up with something that's equally uh, doable. You know, because that's the thing, too. Uh, you want to have it at least where it works. And that's one reason why I do the play alone, so to speak, because I want you to hear what I'm playing and how it matches up with the record. Because, I mean, when you're playing with your band, maybe uh, you, know, uh, you don't necessarily have to play an E minor 7 slash A chord. You can just play an E minor 7 chord. But, you know, when you're playing it along with the records, you want to be as close as possible. And even when you're playing live, you know, the bands that I play, we try to be as accurate as possible, but yet maintain our own identity as far as playing style. Because sometimes I still get this. You should try this chord than that chord. I selected this chord because I think it works better, and this is just my style of playing. It's not that I'm trying to be a carbon copy of the guy on the record, but at least match up what he's doing. And some people just don't get that concept. They think that every guitar player or musician play the same. And those people are not musicians because true musicians understand and respect each other as far as this is your style, I respect it, this is my style, you respect it. You know, so that's going to be DVD number one. DVD number two is going to be uh, dealing with the most asked question that I get. People always ask me this question. All around the world, I get the emails from people saying, how do you get such a good sound? You know, and what setup do you use? Because I'm in the process of put, putting up some uh, YouTube videos, and I want my presentation or covers to sound as good as yours. So what are you using? So in this DVD, I'll walk you through from start to finish what I use, how I use it, and how you can upload your own videos for the sound like mass. Because when I first got on YouTube, there were two types of... Uh, covers. It was the old traditional cover where somebody just takes a camera, hit the record button, the uh, internal mic picks up everything where you got your CD player going and your guitar, get all that white noise and it just sounds terrible. And then the second one where it sounds like you're in the record, alone, playing alone in the record without any outside noise. So uh, I was uh, fortunate enough to, to, to contact some people that kind of walked me through what they did. And once I kind of grasped that concept, I kind of took it to another level, so to speak, so my, my covers can sound even better and cleaner. So that DVD walks you through that. And uh, it's the two-set DVD. And actually, I'm going to give you some more stuff in that second DVD, but that's just the, the main uh, menu or the main topic. But I'm going to add some other additional stuff. But uh, 
they will be available uh, the first of uh, next month. It'll be two DVDs, uh, about 45 minutes a piece in length, and uh, the price is going to be $11 plus shipping and handling $2. So a total of $13 for the second set of DVDs. Because again, I have DVDs number one through four for $20 plus $2 shipping and handling. Then I'm going to have a uh, DVD group number two, consists of two DVDs, uh, walking you through some more needed uh, exotic chords and easy to finger chords. And then the second one as far as my setup and, you know, some other things regarding setup and just some other things that are beneficial to you. So uh, if you're interested, uh, I'm going to do another video when they're quote unquote ready to be released, probably uh, the last week of this month then I'll let you know that they are available now to, to purchase, so I'll keep you posted. And until next time, take care. Thanks for watching.